Hi, Zach Bassett here with COS Accounting and Tax, doing another video for the Compounding Interest podcast that I have going. Really hope you guys are checking that out. Um, this one's going to be on a way to make money. I'm always going to be trying to find you ways to make money or save money or you know grow for the future. Uh, this one's a great one. If we didn't do your taxes in 2017, 18, or 19, send over your tax returns, drag and drop it into the box below and get a free quote. We will let you know if we can save you money. About 80% of the people that send their stuff into us were able to amend something that was a blaring mistake and get them money back from the government. Uh, and they make money even after paying us. We're gonna, depending on the amount it is, we're gonna make sure that we make it worth your while if say your refund's only 500. In that case, we're gonna lower our fee. Normally it's 500 to amend. In that case, we'd lower our fee to 250 so that we're both getting an equal benefit from it um, even though we're kind of taking a hit on that cost. So there's a lot of different ways we can save you a lot of money. I mean, if you are on a Schedule C in any of those years, absolutely send your stuff over because that's, that's one of the best areas for me to find mistakes and save you money. I mean, so many people have no idea how to take the expenses on their Schedule C tax return. So that you, you would have done a Schedule C if you had a 1099 or a small business. Unless, of course, you do know what you're doing and you set up an LLC S corporation, then you wouldn't do a Schedule C per se. But if you did have 1099 or small business income, I say send your stuff over. That's where a big area to find you money. Uh, it's so easy on your part. You click some buttons and then you're done. Now, another great area is the AOTC. Hopefully you watched the video on the American Opportunity Tax Credit, but if you were in school and all, at all in those three years as a half-time student, send your stuff over. Let us check it out. If you were in school, make sure you let us know when you, when you um, drag and drop and, and fill, out the, uh, fill out the form. Let us know that you were in school at least a half-time student. Uh, that way we can because if you didn't put it on there at all, we're not gonna know that you were even in school. So that's the only time where you'd really need to let us know anything. For everything else, we're gonna get back to you and let you know, okay, look, we need this and this. Um, it'll be things you can give off the top of your head most of the, most of the time, so it makes it really easy. Uh, there's a lot of other areas where mistakes can be made, just you know, blaring, maybe someone didn't itemize, uh, they, or they itemized instead of taking the standard deduction and the standard deduction was more than double what they itemized. That happens when people do their own tax return because they click a button choosing to itemize anyway. It ends up costing them $1,000 or more. You may have done that. We can just check and see and let you know. If we don't find any savings for you, it's $0. So we're gonna spend our time trying to find you money uh, and it's not gonna cost you anything. Unless we can save you great money, at that point we'll let you know hey, we can get you $5,000 back. It's going to cost $500. So definitely check that out. If you're a small business owner and you do have an entity like an S-Corp, it's another great area. You know, I specialize in S-Corporations. So oftentimes I'm able to find so not necessarily mistakes, but additional things in the code that can save you money. That's one of the biggest things. A lot of people think, well, there's definitely no mistakes in my return. Well, there, might, there may not be, but they may not know all the different things that an S corporation or a partnership can do. So if you have an S corp or a partnership, send that stuff over as well. We'll take a free look at it. Definitely doesn't hurt to be 100% sure of that, that you got the best tax outcome, does it? Uh, in my opinion, it's a no brainer. Should, you should do it with every year, drag and drop get it reviewed. If not by us, do it through somebody else. Just have it reviewed. People make mistakes all the time. Hopefully uh, that kind of gives instructions. Really all I'm saying is to, to drag and drop your tax returns, have, them, have us do a free uh, consultation on it, and hopefully save you money. Easy video.
Thanks.